Hey guys, I'm sick. Uh, no, for real, I really am sick. Like, um, it's mostly like a sore throat kind of thing. I felt like, like I woke up, actually start at the beginning last night. Uh, my throat was like kind of hurting and I was like, oh, whatever, like, I'll be fine. So, this morning, Alex and I both worked at 11 today and so we stopped at Holiday to get some tea. Ended up buying a little box. Okay, so I have a couple things to address. First off is, Caitlin, did you know the main had their pictures taken by someone with the last name of Flynn? That's pretty cool if you ask me. Yeah, Kelsey's obsessed with Iowa. Iowa doesn't really have anything. And like, I'm not a hater, but the only thing cool that I can actually think of right now about Iowa is actually two things. Iowa's two things that are kind of cool. Okay, the first one is on their license plates. Did you know that like, it says what county they're from. So, like, if cop pulls kids over late at night, where are your kids from? They can't lie because it says on the license plate. That's kind of cool, I thought. The other thing cool about Iowa is they have windmills. If you've, like, driven through Iowa, I don't know, you've probably seen them. But they're really cool. Like, there's just, like, hundreds of windmills in the middle of nowhere. And it's really cool because they're all a football field apart from each other. But like when you're from the distance, it doesn't look like they're that far apart from each other, but it's really cool because they are. I've taken pictures of them before. You can probably see them on my Flickr. I don't know. But they're pretty cool, I guess. So, I mean, I wasn't that bad, but... Haley, I don't know why it is. Whenever I talk to you, I always say creepo. But every time else, I usually say, oh, creeper, like... I don't know. It's kind of like when I video chat with you, I always have to eat something because Haley's always hungry and she's always snacking on something and that makes me hungry when I wasn't hungry before. So if I gain 15 pounds because of college, I'm not a freshman so I can't say it's a freshman 15 so maybe if I get a sophomore stomach or something, it's because of Haley and me talking to her too much. I, like, I don't really speed, I guess. The only time that I do speed is like, you know how when you're driving, like there's some people who are just like zooming in and out and blah, blah, blah. Well, I don't, I do not follow them because that's just scary. But like if traffic, I just go with the flow basically. Yeah. I'm not the leader. You won't see me driving in front of everyone and trying to like get to where I have to go because usually I'm not in a rush. When I'm by myself, I'm not in a rush. When I'm with my sisters, we're always late. Always, always, always. I don't think we've ever been on time. And if we have been on time, we forgot something and had to turn around and go home. And then we were still late. So, I'm not a speeder. I am only speeding if there's someone in front of me. Like, and I'm not going to be a grandma driver. I'm just going to kind of, you know, just, just go with the flow. Um, I like to be on the watch out for cops. I'm pretty good at that. Um, if there's cars in front of me that are going super fast, all of a sudden they break. That means that there's a cop up ahead. So, yeah, that's when I kind of check and see how fast I'm going. But I don't like to speed. One time I was speeding, and Katie, like, I was going five over or something, and Katie was freaking out. She's like, oh my gosh, Emily, you're going to get pulled over. You're wasting gas. I read in Reader's Digest that if you speed over whatever, if you speed at all, then you're going to be wasting 9% more gas than you would if you were going the regular speed. And I just helped pay you for gas, so you're not going to be speeding because that's my gas money. No, no, no. Seriously, she almost had a cow in the car. Not even joking. Greece. I want to go to Greece and Rwanda, Africa, because I think we need to realize that it's not all about us. Africa is really rich, or they could be really rich, but we stole all their stuff, not just the United States, but every other country pretty much took something from Africa. We kind of picked on it, and now we're not really helping it, at least not to the extent that some people could. Not that I'm saying we need to all like put our money into like rebuilding Africa, but I'm just saying like it's there and it's a problem and we should help out so that's what I think um the question that Caitlin asked was what is in our CD player I use my iPod I don't have a CD player sorry Caitlin so I actually do have a CD player but it has an adapter so you can plug your iPod in so I listen to my iPod um I've been listening to a couple things Forever the Sickest Kids 
um, and Linden and Demi Lovato. That's basically my top three playing right now. I like it. It's catchy. And I would say Paramore, but that's so, like, stereotypical right now. So, yeah. That's what I've been listening to. Katie wants to know what her favorite smell is. My favorite smell is currently Febreze. I love Febreze. I have this kind, and it's like a limited edition kind, and it's like spring something, but it smells so good. And I spray it all the time. And I also have to say, Kelsey, I do love dryer sheets. They are amazing. Amazing. And Kelsey wants to know what our superpower would be if we could have a superpower. I would probably pick to be able to fix problems with the snap of my fingers. That'd be an awesome superpower. Like, if I was having a problem, I'd just be like, bam, and then problem solved. Yay! Okay, really quick. My question this week is, what kind of games did you play growing up? I am very, very, very tempted to tell the story about the manor game, but I am really going overboard with the length of this video anyway, so I'm not going to tell the story about the manor game, but I will tell you about tea party games. Um, Megan and Katie decided to have a tea party one time. We were like five maybe and they decided to have a tea party downstairs And I wanted to play with them So I went downstairs and I'm like, oh, can I come to your tea party? And they'd be like, no, you weren't invited and I'd be like, oh, ouch And they made each other invitations to the tea party So I made myself an invitation But then Megan and Katie when I brought it to them, they said it wasn't legit So they, they wouldn't let me play with them So I went upstairs crying because I was really upset I really wanted to play tea party. I love tea parties. Um, and then my dad asked me why I was crying. And then I told him. And then he <laughs> brought me downstairs and he made the girls play with me. But by then, who wants to play with each other while dad forces you to play together? So I wasn't invited to the tea party. There's a story for you in under a minute. I just wanted to say thank you to everyone who's been watching our videos religiously. It means a lot. Um, the other day, this girl, her name is Emily. She's pretty cool because, first of all, her name is Emily, and second of all, she's just cool like that. But she was saying how she watched all of our videos, and it made me really happy, and it was like, oh, sweet, like, people actually watch these. I know, like, it says under views how many times it's been viewed, but you never know if that's just me watching my video over and over and over. It'd be kind of weird if I did. Good thing I don't. Um, so I just want to say thanks. Um, I was talking to Haley and we were saying how, oh yeah, so-and-so said that they've been watching our videos and it's really kind of cool. So, thank you for watching our videos. Tell your friends to subscribe because it'd be pretty sweet if we got some awards. I always wanted an award on my YouTube channel, but I don't think it's going to happen. But someday, somehow, I will get one. Yeah. So other than that, thanks. And I will see you guys next Monday. Have a great week. And tomorrow is Megan, so hi, Megan. <laughs>